It's a body of water that was so polluted for so long, it was often referred to as America's Forgotten River. But thanks to a slow and steady cleanup effort, the Anacostia River has improved to the point where aquatic life can actually be seen swimming in its waters again. This is the clearest I've ever seen the water down here. And now the continued improvement of the Washington DC River rests with the freshwater mussel, the part clam, part snail-like shellfish. I see it's squirting water. Marine biologists from the Anacostia Watershed Society have released over 26,000 native mussels into the river. They act as sort of a natural vacuum cleaner to cleanse the water. Mussels are our um, filter, filter feeders. So they help clean the water. Uh, one mussel of the size of the mussels we're collecting today can filter between 10 to 20 gallons of water a day. So when you add up the numbers in a year, that, that's a lot of water that they can filter. The mussels filter the equivalent of 106 Olympic-sized swimming pools of water every year. This is what they filtered in less than two hours. But propagating mussels and reintroducing them to the river has had a dual impact clean the river and help keep them from going extinct. In the United States, um, we need to work to conserve mussels because greater than 70% of them are listed as endangered, threatened, or are just of like conservation concern. Um, and there's like 300 species of freshwater mussel in the United States. So when you think of like 70% of that 300 species, um, they are at great risk and they need help. In many ways, these mussels are coming home because before this river got so polluted it killed most of them off, there are more than eight different types of mussel species that lived here. It was in 2018 biologists started reintroducing them in an experimental project, and it appears to be working. For a once polluted river, now on its way back to being healthy, thanks in large part to a most unlikely shellfish. Gabriel Elizondo, Al Jazeera, Washington.